Hi, I'm Jack. I'm the new social media outreach member for the Department of Entomology at the University of Kentucky. When I started here, I needed to be acclimated to the bug lifestyle. So naturally, I was locked in a room with a collection of live bugs. Now, I was fine with most of them, even venomous ones like the Black Widow and Brown Recluse. But that was until I had to come face to face with one bug that I'm really afraid of. Really, the only bug and animal I have a total fear of, tarantulas. I am absolutely terrified of these things. Even while researching, I had a chill running down my spine every time I would see one on my screen. That got me thinking, how come I can't stand these things but love jumping spiders? Now, I've liked most spiders for a long time now. I've been kind of into them because of one wall crawler. A segment of Planet Earth got me to see the life of a jumping spider, and I can tell that other people love them because of the success of things like Lucas the Spider. I even found evidence of people swooning over them on TikTok. So why is it that I, and likely a lot of other people, adore this, but can't stand this? Well, the explanation is simple. He's baby. The University of Oxford helps us out with this explanation. We as humans are drawn to things that remind us of babies, and it isn't attributed to just homo sapiens. Attributes like a big, charismatic head, a retreating chin, and most importantly, big eyes catch our attention the most. Now there's lots of examples of this in pop culture recently. We have Baby Yoda, Baby Groot, and most importantly, Baby Nut. So even though tarantulas and jumping spiders are equally non-threatening to humans, the small size and the adorable huge eyes of the jumping spider let us accept it more than their bigger brothers. Which is a good thing. Spiders are hunters of other bugs that we consider more pest-like. Think about their cuteness and their usefulness next time you come face to face with one of these guys. Or should I say, face to cephalothorax. Thank you all so much for checking out Kentucky Bugs. We'll have a new video up on the YouTube every week. Uh, if you're bugging for even more content, feel free to check out our TikTok. We'll have multiple videos up there a week. We've also got an Instagram and Facebook for you to check out. And until then, I will see you next week. I'll leave you with a little joke. What do you like to call an ant that likes to be alone? An independent. See y'all next time.